is that? It is. What's a human like you doing way out here? Wait. What's that smell on you? Ugh. What in the world happened to you? You smell nothing like a human. Hey, are you even listening to me? Uh, you don't look so good. Hey, hey, wait, don't, don't get up so fast. Don't worry, I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm just a little curious, that's all. <laughs> right, I'm a wolf. Good to know whatever's wrong with you hasn't gone to your brain at least. <laughs> uh, sorry. That's a bad habit of mine. I laugh in bad situations. Nervous tick, I guess. Mm, well, to be fair, I'm not a full wolf. Well, I am, but just a little human, too. It's complicated. I'm part of a unique wolf species. Or a monster girl, as you humans call them. Uh, anyway, it looks like something attacked you. That's a pretty big... Uh, is that a bite? What did you run into? A bear? Your friend. <laughs> uh, sorry, pal, but... Last I checked, friends don't go around biting you. Unless it's love bites. Us canines do that sometimes. So what you're saying is that it was your friend, but not really? Hmm. I'm not sure I understand. Explain it to me slowly. Hmm. Oh. Oh, okay. So, a group of your friends went out to hunt, and they never came back. Then you must have went out to find them, and... Oh. Wow. Oh, that's terrible. So, one of them turned into a monster. Oh, I'm so sorry. Mm. I know this doesn't really mean anything, considering we don't know one another, but I do understand. I've lost a lot of family to all kinds of things. Even humans. Oh, uh, no, no, no. I, I don't hate you. Sure, some humans are mean, but I've also met good ones, too. One even gave treats to my pack leader. Can you believe it? <laughs> well, it wouldn't really feel right to leave you out here like this. That wound of yours isn't looking too great, so it needs treating. Hmm? <laughs> hey, just because I'm a wolf doesn't mean that I'm stupid. Look, I have hands too, see? Now, let's get a fire going to keep you warm. If I'm going to treat you, I also need some light in order to see. Hmm. Uh, I think I left some sticks and things over... Over here? Okay, here they are.
There we go. Now we just need to get it started with this and a little bit of oxygen. And we have fire. <laughs> Alright, let's take a closer look at that wound of yours. Let's just take this stuffy jacket off real quick. like that. Look, I, I know you humans don't have any fur, but come on. We're talking about a serious situation here. Who cares if I see some of your skin? <laughs> I'm glad you understand. Now let's let it breathe while I take a good look. Pretty bad. Mm. Listen, human, I know this may seem strange, but I'm gonna need to clean that wound up if you want any chance of surviving. Not only that, but uh, it looks like there's some sort of curse inflicted on you. Unfortunately, I'm not much of an herbalist, nor am I what you'd call a healer. I do know how to clean wounds, though, but... <laughs> um, are you sure you want to know? Uh, I'm sure to a human like you, it's pretty gross. Uh, Alright, well, if you don't want me to clean it in the wolf way, that's fine. I mean, it's not like my species has special healing properties in our saliva or anything. <laughs> I mean, come on. You think wolves like me don't fight all the time? We need some way to heal ourselves after battle. I'm not sure how it will work on a human, but this may be your only option. You're pretty far out in the woods. I'd say it'd take you at least two days to find yourself to the nearest village or town. Like I said, I know to you it may seem a bit gross, but it's the only choice you have right now. It's either I clean up that wound and take out the curse, or... Yeah, I didn't think you'd want the alternative. If you don't want to die, then you'll probably turn into whatever that monster is. 
the one that bit you. <sighs> okay, now that we have that settled, let's get started, shall we? And don't worry, I won't eat you. I know how your human brain works, and believe it or not, wolves don't always want to eat humans. Besides, you stink anyway. Okay, here we go. Just give me a few minutes, and it should be cleared up in no time. say it's beginning to clear up a bit now. How do you feel? <laughs> really? After all that, you want to know what you taste like. <laughs> Typical small-brained human. If you must know, then you taste disgusting. Or maybe I should say that monster tastes disgusting. Mmm. Whatever that curse was hid your true scent, so I'm not sure. Would you like me to eat you to find out? <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Jokes aside, you should probably get some rest. Even though the curse is gone, some good shut-eye will do you good considering your condition. Cuddle? You humans are so needy. Alright, but only on one condition. When you're up and feeling better, you give me treats. I scratch your back, you scratch mine, right? Is that how the saying goes? Good, I'm happy you understand. Now, let's get a bit closer to the fire and we'll cuddle, as you humans call it.
There we go. Nice and warm. Go ahead and get nice and cozy in my fur. Isn't it nice and fluffy? I take a lot of pride in my fur. Go ahead, give me compliments. It's very... It's pretty nice resting together like this. I'm getting pretty tired myself. You better make sure to give me some treats when you feel better, human. <laughs> 